Hello everyone, how are we all doing? How are we all? Say hello in the chat. Mark, what's going on? Small. Oh, yeah. Small, you're doing it as well. Nice. I haven't seen you for a while. I've been lurking. Okay, boys and girls, we are going to try and get the season done today. Oh, uh, Andre, what's going on? Miles, how you doing? Angel, what's going on? Joannis, hello. Zazoro, how are you? Uh, David, what's going on? Dizzy, hello. Okay, let's. Um, I want to crack on today, boys. I think we're going to do what we said yesterday in terms of uh, maybe one game play, instant result the other. I mean, it's it's pretty easy, right? Corey, hello. I've been watching the vids, been a bit busy with my dad as he's diabetic. Ah, okay. Uh, Nick, what's going on, mum? Simon, how you doing? Yeah, I think um. I signed Eduardo, yeah. Someone said they signed Rossi as well. I might have to bring him in just to see what happens. I might bring him in. And Eduardo, to be fair. <laughs> so Rossi is willing to join. Um Yeah, someone else in the in the in the um in the Discord said they signed Rossi, Eduardo. I might pop a little um a little bid in for him, you know, no bonuses, stuff like that. You say Eduardo as well. Uh which had is, is so uh, is it this Eduardo? Yeah, it'd be this Eduardo. Let's let's bring him in. Let's bring two new strikers in. As an impact sub. Okay. Okay, we'll go with that. <laughs> I finished season one. No spoilers. No spoilers. Matthias, what's going on, man? Yes, boys, if you don't mind liking the video, that would be massively appreciated. Please drop a like in if you just joined. Uh, I have another account I watch on, but I have Discord name as this. Always lurk. No, no, that's fine. Nothing wrong with lurking. So, yeah, we're... um, Matthias, why don't you give this a go? I know you're bored. You're spending more time in the stream. It's pretty obvious. Why don't you give it a go? Patsy, how you doing, man? Also got Mike on Kim Young Seung. On my way to work, empty trains. Why are you working? What do you do, Miles? I was close to get Bentner. Oh, really? I try. Is he a free transfer? The Lord himself. How do you spell his name? Is it... <laughs> it's a free agent. <laughs> Nicholas Bentner, please. Oh, he's interested. Okay, let's see if he comes in. Okay. They don't know anyone else. Just, just for a laugh. Does anyone know anybody else who was like old kind of legend type status who we could potentially bring in? Who do you think? Um, how come you're not giving away just these plays? You're getting on freeze because we're an amateur club. Um, so yeah, we don't have to pay for them. All of our squad is amateur, as you can see. The club itself is amateur. <clears throat> um. This is a joke save. It's so fun, man. It's so fun. Hugo Almeida. Hugo Almeida. How do you spell it? Ah, oh, he's got a club. Eh. I mean, we might as well bring a few in. We've got less chance of these. I, must, I don't know which mate. Is it this one, the right back? I mean, it's 38. Should, should we bring him in? Oh, he's not interested. Okay. Peter Crouch, I doubt it. He's retired now, isn't he? Yeah, he's a coach. Uh, Ross McCormack. He's a free agent. Can't keep signing strikers. And it's not that bad, to be fair. Like, impact sub as well. Got less chance of these leaving if we bring a few old and, old and goldies in, I guess. Uh, what's my club rep? Two, two, uh, two star. Yeah, two star. Kaka. Mathis, can you think of anyone? I can't think who's a free transfer. I don't know. Is Kaka still even on the game? Search by international caps. Yeah, I don't think they'll show though because I haven't got my um. Uh, what's it called? I haven't got no package. So I don't think it'll work. I mean, I could try, but I don't think it will. Um, what would this be under club? 
uh, international caps. There's at least 50. Here we got. Oh, so Bender's actually there. Okay. Uh, Asamo Agayan. I don't really recognize anyone else. It could be a shout, you know. All pretty decent. Maybe go down to like 40. 20. Yeah, okay. I mean, we'll, we'll bring one or two in. That's, that's not a problem. Yeah, yeah, Torre. Ronaldinho in the game. <laughs> Doid, I've seen him already. <laughs> so we just signed Rossi up front. I mean, we're probably never going to play him, but it's it's you know it's nice to have a few um yeah a few legends in the game. Pablo, this guy interested? <laughs> He's interested. Oh, I'm just signing everybody. Let's stop. I can't keep doing this. Yeah, I can't keep signing lots and lots of players. Um, yeah. I mean, to be fair, we're going to lose quite a few of them coming up to January anyway, so. Michael Essien, maybe. Ah, oh, he's got a club. I, don't, I can't find him. Okay, I think that's enough. We're, we're going to play this game to start the stream, of course. Um, I do need a left winger, though. I'm a little bit short on the left wing. If anyone knows anyone, maybe like an older guy. Um, yeah, I can't seem to find it. I've, I've only got one left winger, and Ate is a bit unfit. So I can't think what left winger I could use. Okay, let's let's start the game with a win. We are winning one 0 which is nice. We did win in the cup yesterday as well, don't forget. So we are we are in a little cup run, even though we've only won one, but we are on a cup run. It'll be quite a big stream today, boys. Hopefully you guys who's staying through the stream the entire length today. What what's the plans? What's your plans today? To Oppy, what's going on, man? Uh Carlitos saw him pop up in the search, unsure whether he's the one I'm thinking of. Half disallowed. Anyone who's doing the save, who you got on the left wing? I'm gonna need a left winger. How you doing, Rick? Oh, that guy he scores so many world like so many good goals. Um is FM Scout your only job? No. FM Scout does nowhere near pay the bills. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's just my hobby. Uh, watching your stream whilst doing my own save with Anderlecht, nice. If job is quiet, I'll be, I'll be around. Plan staying home, <laughs> yeah, that's, I guess. Have you heard the news, by the way? I don't know if you've heard, but Boris Johnson's got, um, coronavirus. You've probably seen it. The lawyers. I mean, we're going to have a little look around for some players in um, in January anyway, because I'm assuming we're going to lose a lot in January. So we'll have a look for a few players then. I'm, I'm assuming at this point, yeah, a few is going to leave. If I'm scouting because free beer? No, definitely not. Oh, Alan. Oh, nice goal. So yeah, we we are going to kind of speed through this season because it is very easy. We know this. I keep going over this. So we are going to speed through. We're going to instant resort a few games as well because we know we're going to win the league. It's, it's pretty obvious, to be honest. And I really want to get to maybe the next season after this, to be fair. Should go pro by them. Doid, come get some love in the chat. Doid has joined. Uh, Doid is a member. So thank you very much, man. 
Can we get some GG in the chat for Doid? Uh, if you want a player, please let me know. I'm naming the players after... Um... Yeah, if, if you want a player, let me know. Watching from Portugal while managing leads to the quarterfinals of the Champions League fourth season. Nice. Oh, nice. That was a great touch. What a pass that was. Holy shit. How many people in the um, in the stream are doing Billionasis? I know there's a few now. There's probably like 10 people doing it. I want Bentner. Yeah, I mean, I'm definitely going to play Lord, the Lord up front if we get him. <laughs> oh, it's going to happen. Mate, what's going on? Spyro. Doing alright though, Spyro. 11 goals. Who's been... If, if you're doing the save... Oh, there's so many people doing it, man. You guys are absolute legends. <laughs> like, none of you would have done this if I didn't do it. And it's it's so good to see other people do it. Um, But yeah, if who's been your favourite signing so far? Like, I know there's been some absolute wonders like Rossi coming through, Bentner. People signing some, like... Yeah, people signing some really good good players. It's crazy. I think Alan Ruiz is probably the best that you could sign at this level, really. He is really good, let's be honest. You know? Can we get this third goal and kill the game? A guy called Yaya. Or Jaja. You need to get this guy. Which guy, Patsio? I uh, wish I had time to do this save. I'm very tempted, though. just don't know how to put the database on my Mac. Uh, I'm sure someone in the chat can help you. <laughs> I love how you're all signing Ram Kilday as well. Oh, I'm taking full credit for that signing. I don't think any of you would have knew about him if it wasn't for me. Uh, let's be honest. No one would have signed Ram Kilday. I was the first person to sign him this year. I'm telling you. I I'm going to debate anyone else who says differently. You signed Victor Anabishi? Really? Is the Lord going to join? I'm going to actually play him in the game. Um, I can't really think of a left winger to buy. Um, Matthias, who did you say? Sorry. Have a quick look. I mean, can my director... Let's have a look. We haven't looked at the director yet, you know. I wonder if he'll suggest kind of like... Um, old, old book gold is... What's the word? I can't think of the saying. It doesn't look like it. Oh, Fred Friday. Oh, I want to sign Fred Friday just for the name. Should we sign Fred Friday? <laughs> it's actually pretty good. It's only 24 as well. I've got to sign Fred Friday just for the name. What do you reckon? Okay, we've got the most ridiculous squad ever. We know a lot of these are going to go. Some really good players. Did they not find... Was there no left wingers then? Sorry. Rafael Garcia is pretty shit, to be honest. Tommy Hoban, is that Ipswich guy? Nope. Tommy Hoban's a really good signing, man. Tommy, I'm, I'm actually going to sign Tommy Hoban. I said I wasn't going to sign any more players. What am I doing? Just too, like, it's, it's too hard not to. That's not how I think it is, is it? That's not the Guillerme from... Um... Is that the Guillerme from the Madeira save? It's not right. I can't remember who he was at. Okay, that's fine. Mareshi. Ha, <laughs> Sven, what's going on, man? 
Let's have a look at Mareshi. It doesn't help where you guys could just keep telling me players. Eh. Good for him. Uh, Aaron. Niguez. He played there, though. I mean, yeah, I mean, he's really good as well. Stop signing players, Jamie. Oh, he wants a few, um... Okay, I, I'm not signing no more. Nope, I'm not signing any more. Why don't you sign, try and sign Sancho? <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna happen. How are these players accepting dog shit contracts? Like, bruh, like, I don't know, try it yourself. It'll do the same for you, if you try and did it. <laughs> oh, boys, the Lord is in. Oh, Nicholas Bentner joins. Oh, dear me. <laughs> Nicholas Bentner. What a signing. Stefan, come get some more love in the chat. GG in the chat for Stefan, boys. He's just become a member. Uh, Ross McCormack, what the most random signing in the world. <laughs> Save is going to go off. I can't think of anyone else. There's no one else popping up. But we'll bring a few in. We're going to lose them all anyway. Like, you know, some of these are quite old. They might just decide to decide to kind of stay at the club. You don't know. Once we go from amateur to semi-pro, yeah, they might decide to stay. Or accept really, really cheap contracts. Fred Fry is in as well. Reshe is better than Ruiz. 3am in, no worries, I had to catch a save. Did you, have you been catching up on this? Um, okay. Spyro's moaning a little bit. Because of San Eduardo. I've got so many strikers, I think. Um... We do lose a player right here though, Majika leaves. We've got a few players leaving. Uh, it's it's going to be interesting this. I'm going to play this game because I just want to, in fact, three more joining here. Okay. Right, I, I think we're all good at least for the next few, few months, I think. Um, I mean, how many strikers have I got? Yeah, I mean, I mean these three are I'm just gonna actually release these. Oh, they're being bidded for, so I can't. Okay, so I mean we've got a decent sized team, I guess. Lenderman for right back because Majika is leaving. What is your manager rep at? It's the lowest. Fred Friday played a lot of games in Eredivisie two years ago. How the fuck did he get him to sign? I mean, it's not just me. I mean, it really looks like I'm cheating, but I, honestly, I am not. There's about 12 people in the stream who's playing the exact same save with the exact same database who can vouch for me. So that's good news because it's not just me. Everyone can sign players like this. Because you're amateur um, and you've got high rep in such a low league, you can attract very, very good players. It's always been known on Football Manager. Um, it's like when you do an English English level 12 or something. Um, yeah, you can sign really good players to that league and just walk the league. So the save is going to get harder. Like once we get to semi-pro, we won't be able to sign the players with signing. So we're just going to enjoy doing it now. Um, we are two-star, but you don't understand that these are being a Premier League club. For years and years and years, so I I don't see why you conf why why are you a bit annoyed that they're two star, like they're a big club, until just, you know when they got the the demotion. You know they've been in the Champions League. You know they 
to be fair, finishing quite high in, in the Premier League, so I don't think two-star is, is bad, to be honest. And they've won the Premier League before, so... <laughs> Shut up, Mark. <laughs> they don't know how I can find free agents in the second season because I've lost half my team. What team are you doing, Adam? Are you doing Bellinis as well? Uh, who is the guy you just suggested for the right back? Marcia, what's going on? Linderman. I mean, he's half decent. I guess he'll do for when Majika leaves. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I guess you just have to look at your... Um, usually, I mean, to be fair, your director picks up some really good players at amateur level. Like... Yeah. I, I would definitely use the director. At this level, they always find better players better than the actual level. Um... So yeah, I mean, if I was to look for a right back director, like Tyro Mears, I mean, and it was thirty six, but they'll do a job, you know. Ezekiel, they're watching Walking Dead here. Great name, pretty good as well. But yeah, I mean, this guy's twenty four. He's got fifteen tackling. So I, I really would use your director to find a few players at least. I've just lost your Gino, I think. What players are free? Uh, I mean, we, we've looked through most of them. We, we haven't got a... Um, we haven't got a scouting package, so it's quite hard at the moment. I'm just signing people that people are suggesting. <laughs> um. So, yeah. Is, I think Benny is one of the guys. No, he's not. I thought Benny was one of the guys that I signed, but he's not. What have I missed? No, we just made a few more signings, Holmes. <laughs> a few interesting signings, to say the least. You want to have a little look who have signs? Um, so we've just picked up Asadi, Mareshi, Tommy Hoban, Nig Niguez, Niguez, Fred Friday, Pablo Armero, Ross McCormack, Nicholas Bentner, Eduardo, and Rossi. <laughs> That's the most random players to sign in the world. Oh, I don't know who to play up front. That's the problem. I'm going to instant result this game, though. Um, Niguez comes in now. Tommy Hoban goes in at ball playing defender. I feel like I want to play the Lord. I'm going to give the Lord a little game. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Rossi is injury prone. Luckily, I've got lots and lots of strikers. So, what players, I mean, are available? I mean, it's up to you, Stefan. Take a pick. There's lots. Hat tricking coming. What for the Lord? Oh, he didn't score. Yeah. yeah, we'll play the next game, boys. I'm gonna do, I want an instant result like every every other game. We will play the next game, just so we can get through this season. Get Yaya Toro. I doubt we will be able to. He's got a club. How big is the squad now? Very very big. But we've got a lot of players leaving. So. I'm having bids and bids. Like, look how many players. Look at all these bids for players. I don't think anyone's decent. Who's leaving? Who's leaving? Cesar was the guy I signed, actually. He's already joining someone. So, yeah, we are losing players, but it's kind of expected. How do you instant result? You have to have the skin. The um, We just signed Linderman, though, on that right-hand side. I think that's everybody in now from our side. I mean, a lot of these are rejecting clubs, so... Yeah. It's interesting though, isn't it? Some of these, um... 
Some of these players you can sign. Like, a lot of them are snubbing. It's almost like, I mean, he's a DM. Let me just release that guy. Don't they have a pro contract? No, we don't. Um, because we're, we're an amateur club. Is there a skin just for the instant result without any other additions? I mean, to be honest with you, this um, this skin is very identical almost to the main skin. Why I've used this for four years. I, I would really recommend One Chop. It's a really good skin. I'm going to keep checking my director though because, you know, there, there will be a few good players. I bet if you press, um, I bet if you try and do it with transfer, you know, no players, okay, and yeah, maybe not them. Where can I get it from? It's on the FM Scout uh, website. I might take the Lord Bent. You want him, Lord Bentner? I mean, just look at them strikers. Oh, I mean, come on. That is the most diverse bunch of strikers you've ever seen. Ooh. There you go. You are Lord Bentner. Alexander Pantic is a natural ball playing defender. Yeah, Mareshe did sign. I don't think he's going to get a game at the minute, though. Uh, what face pad do you use? I have no idea. Scope, I think. FM20 content, what's going on? But yeah, Mareshe signs. All right, we'll play this game, though. I want to I wanna keep playing Lord Bentner up front. We have just lost our right back, which is a little bit annoying. Why does what sound available? How long are you streaming for? I mean, my plan is to kind of get the season done. Amazing place. Yeah, I would love to go. Uh, I'll have a look what story is, Patsio. I'm not entirely sure. Um, can't even find him, to be honest. Yeah, I have no idea where he is. T players aren't going into under 19s, are they? Oh, they are. Some players. Huh. No wonder I couldn't find Ram Kilday. He's been putting me under 19s. Okay. <laughs> Got another striker. <laughs> Um, Areshe, yeah, he's like two and a half. I wonder where Ram Kilday was. Can't believe you have signed a player like Alan Ruiz. I mean, believe it, because you can do it as well if you did the save. It's not like an amazing piece of skill that I signed him. It's doable. Okay, we are going to play this game, though. <laughs> Is the Lord going to get his first his first goal? So we have lost our right back, of course. Uh, Tommy Hoban. I'm really poor on the um, on the right back side of things. Lindemann's all right. I'll do the job, I think. Um, I want to play the Lord. Where is he? So many players. We've got Fred on the bench as well. So, okay, let's play the Lord. It's really cool to see a foreign man managing in Portuguese lower league. Greens from Portugal. Hello, how are you? Rossi scoring on the debut for me. 
Oh, I've got Rossi on the bench. I have. I've got Rossi on the bench. I might bring him on. <laughs> it's so weird. Oh, uh, so weird. Enrique, it's one nil. I need to get rid of Enrique as soon as possible. Really. Like, can you imagine the type of players you're gonna be able to bring in when you are like in the second tier and stuff? Though, uh, with the rep being quite good, it's um, it's gonna be interesting. Cause what's the rep of Benfica and Porto? Like three and a half star, four star maybe a uh, push. Uh, being two star is is it not a bad. It's not a bad start. The lawyers. Oof. January second, he was gone. Yeah, I mean. If you're not doing this save, like a few people have been telling me who are doing this save and are a bit further, that they are losing so much money. Um, yeah, it's it's uh, it's crazy. Because we've got like good training facilities, good ground, good youth facilities, the money is just going down and down. Uh, people have messaged me saying they're in the red already. Oh, the Lord. Oh, he's offside. <laughs> oh, I thought he scored. I mean, we're not in the red as of yet. So, I mean, we're not going to get any money for winning the league. So, there's literally no money coming in anywhere. Um, oh, my Lord. Bentner. Oh, the Lord has scored. A mistake by the keeper. Nicholas Bentner. <laughs> Who would have thought we would have signed this guy? In the fifth tier of Portugal. <laughs> he actually kicked it as his own guy. I thought he was off Bentner. I mean, this is why FM's so good, boys. Like, just who would have thought Rossi and Bentner would be playing for Billy Nasus in the fifth tier of Portugal at amateur club? Like, you, you just wouldn't have thought it, right? Uh, how do you do the save? What part of the Discord is it in? Uh, there's a there's a section for Billy Nasus, um, on the left hand side, just below the YouTube bit. Uh, if you check the pin section, it's almost like you cheated. Cheated for what? And Kendi, Aaron, the lawyers. Oh, the Lord has made it too. You vape? I do. Lord Bentner is he's going for his hat trick, boys. He is. He's going for his hat trick. Look at him. Oh, oh, the Lord is going for his hat trick. Oh, he's actually missed a penalty. <laughs> oh, wow. Also, Anna Rose and Soko named as well. Why do I vape? I mean, why do you think? <laughs> why does anyone vape? I don't vape to be cool. Uh, is this tactic like your 4 2 3 1 from FM19? Yes, it is. Linderman. Go on, crack it. He does score some um, pens too easy for Lord Bentner. Yeah, he's got to do it the odd way. He'd miss that on purpose. Enrique Bentner! Oh, he's wide. I'm Danish and seeing Bentner playing. Billy Nasus is why I love FM. <laughs> oh, I mean, is anyone going to sign him from me? Will he finish his career with us? What do you reckon? Like, who would go and sign... Bentner from me. I don't know who would. It's not a bad thing to have... Oh, oh my lord, what a goal. Oh, I thought the keeper saved that. That is what you call a goal, boys. Holy shit. Damn. Gotta watch this again. I thought the keeper, like, knocked it out. He almost did, to be fair. What is your favourite vape flavour? Um, at the minute, I don't know, something called blackberries, like raspberry and menthol, I think. Do 
your team looks overpowered because it is <laughs> really overpowered. Um, like you guys should really. I, I know this looks really, really easy at the minute, which it is. But if you guys want a bit of fun, sign some legends. You know, we know this save is going to get extremely hard. Like we know this, so just enjoy it while you, while you're winning a few games. Uh, I'm gonna bring Rossi on. Uh, let's bring Asadi on as well. Tactics doing alright, but it's hard to judge it based on kind of who we're playing against and the team we have. I have a uh, complete win back. I scored 19 goals in 21 games. Well, really. Billy Nades has managed to sign that kind of players in real life, it would be crazy. This is why I want to instant result some games, because it is just too easy at the moment. And at least we can, um, this free kick's going in if it's Ruiz. Oh, it's Rossi. Holy shit, it's power on that. Oh, it's another goal. The keeper's having an absolute awful game. <laughs> I don't like our stadium being so empty, but it's fine. Basically, a poor man's into Milan signing all these old men. It's working, though. Like, it's working. We have conceded. What legends are available? I can sign Macon. Um, Rossi, Bentner. Okay, a nice easy win. Uh, have we got? Uh, uh, I think we've got a winter break now, actually, which is nice. I guarantee when we come back from the winter break, would have lost about ten players. I'm gonna guess. But let me see if I can... What's our balance? 222. Our balance is is okay. Like, it's it's really not doing that bad. I don't think I'm going to be able to get any friendlies. We've only got, like, a a month's break. I, I, I don't think we're going to be able to. Here's a league, right? Yeah, there's only small rep teams. Yeah, there's there's not enough teams to do leagues. Uh, which is annoying. So, we, yeah, we can't get any money in during during the winter break. We could probably still do some friendlies, though. Just to keep the match sharpness up. We'll have two friendlies. I kind of want to keep... Oh, no, we've got a game here, actually, on the 26th. The cup. Okay, we, we're going to play one game. Who can I play? Is there any... Oh, there's a larger rep team. Oh, God, I thought that was the main Braga, then. How about foreign? How many fans would Casablanca bring? Maybe we'll go Rio Avi. Let's let's play against Rio Avi. Okay. Um What is the board's reaction? Uh, I don't even know to be honest. Um, it doesn't really say. I can't. I can't remember. Okay, we we'll play Rio Avi at least in a friendly. I have a real good friend playing for Edekio. His name is Ivan. I wonder if he's there though. Ivan Claro. This guy. Not too bad, to be fair. Uh, this is tier 5. Yeah, tier 5. We did get our biggest ever win. Um, I drew one game. Yeah, we drew one. See you later, Stefan, man. Appreciate the um, the dropping by. I 
And thank you for becoming a member. So many bids for my players. What happened to Mischievous Rogue on this channel? What the heck was that? Oh. Great preseason for me so far with Brentford. Played PSV and Juventus. Won 4 0 both times. Nice. Has anyone started this um, Billy Nasus save today? By any chance? Just intrigued to see if anyone started today. I bet you've all signed Alan Ruiz. <laughs> I'll be surprised if no one in the stream has signed him. Managed to basically fill out my squad with director of football suggestions. Cheers, Jamie, you're a lifesaver. Yeah, I mean, you should be able to attract good players for the league. Um, I did see there was a post. Uh, I think it was Droid. Was it Doid? I don't know who it was, but there was a... Um, there was an intake from one of the guys who is doing this save. And he pulled out an absolute quality region. I'll try and find you the picture. One sec. Uh, so this guy, it was Hater actually. So this guy came through the intake at Billion Asus. Oh, I can't do it. I can't show you. Can I take a picture of it? Uh, this guy is pretty good. Like... Okay, it seems like I can't put a link in the Discord channel for some reason. But I, I really think you're going to get some like really good players. There you go. There's the link. I, I really think being Billy Nasus and being in, in like... Um... <laughs> I've just read a comment on YouTube. Here, listen to this from Dick Smith. Here we go again. Four back to back promotions, Champions League in first two seasons in the top flight. Win the league within three. How do you find it fun? I don't know. Okay, boys. I think we're all going to listen to Dick and quit the save. Not continue what you're saying. I've started with the other team, but my rep was so low that I cannot sign. Um, no with your shortlist. Yeah, it's it's all based on the rap. Uh, do you sign free agent regions in the game? Um, not really at the moment, no. Even if he's right, everyone enjoys the game. Is I don't think he is right though. Like we've done Madeira. Like, we've done Madeira for FM18 and FM19, and we have never won the Champions League. Like, I've never managed to win it, so he's actually really wrong. <laughs> yeah, I've never managed to do it. Like, it's easy in England, of course. Anyone in England can do it because you've got so much money. A little bit different in Portugal. Uh, people have fun in a different way. Personally, this is my favourite content. That Madeira save last FM was so fun to watch. Yeah, it was like, it's just so good. The, the amount of regens, and it's, I just really love Portugal saves so much. Hello, Jamie, how are you doing? What's your thoughts on the FA void in the season for teams below the National League North and South? Seeing some low league clubs threatening legal action. Yeah, it's, it's, it was always going to happen, though. They don't find it enjoyable. Why? Why are they even watching? That's what makes you laugh. But like I say, I I just like building the clubs up. I don't, you know. And Portugal is just so. You, you guys who would would have watched the Madeira, you you realize how much fun we have. It, it's so good. 
like signing a player from Africa and you sign him for like zero and then you get a bid for him three years later for 40 million. Highly unlikely in Portugal, but around that, around that price. What do you think will happen to the Premier League? Uh, I'm not sure. Get Bentner on Facebook and Twitter, please. <laughs> Give it an hour and I'll put him on there. I've only just posted that I'm streaming. <laughs> the Lord joins the Portuguese 5th Division Club. 5th Division Amateur Club. I'll pop it on in about an hour. As a Sheffield United fan, I'm praying that the season isn't cancelled. Uh, I don't know. Like, if they, if they void the season... Like, clubs like Norwich are going to massively benefit from it. Whereas clubs like, obviously, Leeds, who are pushing for the promotion and stuff like that, obviously they're going to get um, more money, right? And uh, Norwich. Why does their badge look very familiar to ours? Are these close? That's literally the same. Have they copied our badge but just changed the colours? Are you being serious right now? Am I being framed by a club? Portuguese people in the chat, are these close? I feel like this is like the next town or something. <laughs> I don't know where it is. Oh, not really. Okay. Very similar badge and kind of name. Um, not if they avoid the season, no TV revenue for the team. But they would have had TV revenue throughout the season. That's what I'm saying. And they're going to get it next season. Yeah, I know there's a, yeah, I, I see a few like brother sister clubs around. <clears throat> okay, well, we're going into December now. We've got the cup. We are going to play the cup. Um, we'll get Lord Bentner playing again. Uh, I don't think you get any cash for this cup, to be honest. I, I still, to this moment, I still don't know who. I'm strong. I need to find a right back, I think. I mean, Jao, Jao Oliveira isn't that bad. Maybe I should just make this guy happy again. Let's play Jao Oliveira. Okay, let's go with this, I think. Dale, what's going on, man? Not fair for Liverpool. Yeah, I, I kind of agree. I feel bad if they do void it for Liverpool. Moldy, what's going on? I'm very well. How are you? My birthday tomorrow, boys. Yeah, my birthday tomorrow. We've got a free kick. Is this Ruiz? It is. This is a goal. Oof. Oh, good by the keeper. Portugal has some talent players and some amazing academy prospects. This is why I really like... Like, this is why I think this save is going to be so good. Like, because obviously you guys know, I don't know if you do know, but in terms of youth intakes, like, location is a key factor as well. So, you know, I, I always say, if you're managing a team in Brighton compared to if you're managing a team in Manchester, you're going to get better players from Manchester rather than Brighton because it's bigger populations and, and stuff like that. But we're in Lisbon. So we've definitely got some good players coming through our, our youth intakes, I'm telling you. There will be some great players. And I do, I do shit with youth intakes all the time. That's a great passing. Good football. That's a good call as well. Is this tactic better than 4-4-2? Evan, I don't know. Like, it's so hard to judge at the minute because... We've got such a better team than everybody else. I'm not going to really know until I get to the second league. 
Enjoying the Puskas, Dave Sill finished third in my Europa group. Should have got through, but couldn't beat Dinamo Zagreb. I'm sure you'll find a nice right back easy enough. <laughs> How old? 21. 18, mate. Enrique. Um, anyone who's finished the season with Bill and Asus already, what did you do in this cup? Did you win it or how did you get on? Judging by the teams I've seen, you should be able to win this, right? Bentner! <laughs> the Lord scored their goal of the season. <laughs> did you get any money, Adam? I don't think you'll get any money for it, but... I'm going to ask the board to send me on a... Um, if they'll send me on a coaching. I don't think they will because I've got no staff. I think Tommy Hoban's a cracking signing, you know. Oh, uh, Ruiz loses the ball. Anyone know a league in Europe that doesn't have the rules about non-EU player limitation in squad? Portugal. Kennedy. Portugal has no rules. The Lord has scored two goals. Did he score? A, he scored a hat trick in the last game, right? Is he going to score another hat trick? I think he looks like he's going to. Oh, I've, I didn't know Sweden has no rules. That might be a good save for the next one. I've always wanted to manage in Sweden. It's on my list. Like, I, to be honest with you, I always want to manage in like someone like Croatia or something like that, but I find the rules really difficult. They have some really like um, Czech Republic and um, and Croatia places like that. They have some weird rules. Andy, pass inside. Alan, oh, nice passing. Yeah, the Lord is that trick. Oh. Rossi injured during the break after playing one game. Terminate contract. <laughs> That's the bonus. <laughs> uh, what makes you choose the Portuguese league? Purely because of the financial troubles? Um, That, yes. But it's the story. Getting Billy Nasus back to the um, back to the Premier League. And I've managed in Portugal three years now, three FMs, and it's it's the most like I say it's the most fun save I've ever done. Um, we said yesterday there's three aims of this save. In the order, aim number one is to become a bigger club than Bilinasis, the other team in the Premier League, and, and overtake them. The second aim is to then overpower Porto and Benfica. The third aim is to win the Champions League. Um. A long, long way away. I've I've done this save like, like I say, two years in a row, and I've never won the Champions League. Like winning the Premier League is not an issue. It's it's the Champions League. It's it's horrible because your players constantly get poached by other clubs. Like Man United, if you get any sign of any wonder kids after two years, they'll, they'll be leaving, or the clubs will be making them unhappy. Like I think one of I think it was FM eight nineteen the Madeira save my under twenty threes I think I had about thirty players with like four or five star potential and they was literally just in there to make me money so so yeah I'm, I'm really excited to see Bentner with a hat trick boom two hat tricks for the Lord himself. I don't stream on Twitch now. I prefer YouTube. How did you get Alan Ruiz? Um, same idea. You can I don't know. <laughs> the reps really good. Like everyone else has signed Alan Ruiz as well. You know, if I had a, like someone said take a shot of alcohol every time someone asked about Alan Ruiz, I think I'd be pissed in about ten minutes if that was the case. I'm not doing that. Ha <laughs>
Uh, yeah, I forgot to change the players. My bad. I mean, it's not like we can't rotate, to be honest. I never start with clubs. When do you get bent there? Dale, you missed it. I had a bit of a start of the stream. People were suggesting players to sign for who they've signed. Um, so, <laughs> so we actually signed these at the start of the stream. Uh, I'm sure you recognise a few. Rossi, Eduardo, Bentner, Ross McCormack, Fred Friday, Tommy Hoban. You'll recognise them. I am surprised Ross has not been injured yet, though. He must have that con, surely. How does he not have a con of injury prone? Shots of tomorrow. I've attempted several times to do a save in the MLS, but it's just getting around the rules. Yeah, you'll never ever see me do a save in the MLS. I can almost guarantee that. I will never step foot in the MLS. <laughs> Rossi, yes, definitely. I will instant result this one. Just to be honest, I, I don't think it's going to be long before we get the... Um, Maybe another two months before we get the message about getting promoted. Right, Turkish League. Yeah, Turkish League's good. Search for Ki Sung Young. What position? Uh, I've never tried the Polish League, no. I think the transfer window is about to open, actually. What's his name? Ki Sung. Uh, this, uh, this guy. Now, which one? Oh, I think he's gone to Bologna. Is it that guy you went about? Uh, who is a South African coach who has great stats? Uh, Gordon. Gordon Ewan. Is, it, is that your guy you went about? Yeah, I don't think we can get Gordon just yet. Uh, how many more promotions before you stop buying and selling, do you think? Always fun to watch your transfer strategies. Um, I'm, I, I don't really know. I think we need to get to the first league first. Um, before, I, I don't know. The problem we've got is the... So I'll tell you the issue straight away. The issue with our team straight away is we don't really have any Portuguese players. Now, there's no rules in the league that we're in at the moment, which is fine. For the league, I think it's the third tier. Hang on. I'll show you. So many different groups. Yeah, so, let's say, like, this one. If we look, I don't know if it is the third tier or it's the second tier. So, yeah, so the third tier, you have to have a, the match squad. Must have at least 12 players trained by a club in Portugal. That is a horrible rule. Like, that is the worst rule. <laughs> so, you can almost have, like, just your sub-bench of foreigners while your first team has got to be trained by a club in Portugal. Um, so, yeah, that's obviously we weren't able to do that then. And then, of course, the Secunda, I think, is the same. Um, so B teams. I think the Secunda is fine, actually. Yeah, it's literally just the third team. Uh, the third tier. Because then, of course, the, the, the Premier League. <laughs> There's no, no rules. <laughs> like, no match rules. All you've got to do is register them and they're fine. So, yeah, it's just a third league we need to get through. We're not going to be able to have foreign players. So, really, it's really weird. Paolo Noga.
But I'm assuming once we get to the third tier, we can just kind of raid maybe some some loans. Um, that's that's probably the best way to go. Lloyd, see you later, man. I think the transfer window is about to open. Dasha, what's your youth recruitment at now? Yeah, it looks like. When can I release this? Um... Yeah, when can I release this right winger? I don't want to be spending 1.4k. Signing free agent wonder kids is a good solution for trainer, but B club issue them because you signed them at sixteen. Um, I mean we don't really need to worry about that as of now. Why is the game taking so long? It must be the transfer window. I wonder when we can get our scouting network as well. Oh, we're down to 183k in the bank. Ouch. Yeah, we're going to be in the red by the end of the month. Uh, end of the year. Which is really annoying. So, I mean, what, what we're losing money on at the moment. We don't have any loans or anything like that. Like, so last month, during December, we spent 89k. 30k of that was on the youth cell. Although I don't know what that's that is on expenditure. Probably the chairman just putting his hand in the pocket. And then 14k ground maintenance. So like four like 44k of that is something we can't control. Um play away just 5k, but that's down to the loans, I guess. Which they're gonna go very, very shortly, because I don't need a guy on 1400 pounds a week, even though he is playing for me. It's, it's, it's like almost not worth it. Oh, Mordi, okay. <laughs> you know I forget. You have to remind me. Are they exceptional already? That's crazy. I've, I've got a memory like a goldfish. Uh, this guy. I mean, is he willing to join? Nope. Pretty good there. I'll keep an eye out on him. AIK have challenged Bellinesis for a friendly match on the 27th of January. Um, do, I, do I give that a go? They're, they're three star rep. Will they bring a few? I mean, it's, it's going to get me 35k. I'm, I'm going to accept that. That's quite an interesting um, proposal. Not bad. I'm, I'm going to bring them in, actually. I wasn't expecting anyone to really propose any friendlies with me, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, we'll take that. I know it's a day after one of the games, but... The problem is, there's just no, like... There's no good teams to, to have a friendly with. Um, like all the second teams. Okay. I can't get Benfica Porto or Sporting yet, unfortunately. I kind of upgraded the coaching and recruitment twice in one season. Yeah, I think I'm going to pass on upgrading anything else at the moment. I'm going to avoid it as much as I can. Apart from the scouting range. But I don't think they'll do the scouting range for me. And there's no point in doing scouting range until I can get players on a contract. So. What I do want, why I've got some money, but I don't think they'll let me go on a coaching course. Oh, okay, they've agreed actually. I wasn't expecting that. So they won't, I don't know why it won't find a senior affiliate. 
Like they keep it's so it really annoys me. Can I ask if they go professional? Oh, they can't afford it. I thought they said yes then. Yeah. Yeah, I mean I don't think we'll find a senior affiliate. Has anyone managed to kind of find a senior affiliate? Like imagine having Sporting or Porto. Like just for the first few years would be amazing. It really would. Sven, thank you for becoming a member, man. Welcome. Yeah, I, I don't think they'll find one while you're amateur. I think once you get to semi-pro, um, it'll be fine. Thank you, Sven, man. Appreciate it. Should we keep the Lord up front? Hey, finally indeed. Okay, let's uh, instruments all this. I need to nip to the loo. I'm going to keep the Lord up front. We have just lost another right back. Or another... Um, get Lenderman back in, actually. Now, I'm going to keep um, Oliveira, though. I want to try and get him happy. Please don't lose. Come on, don't lose. But Lord Bentner has had three, two at tricks in two games. Is he going to get three at tricks in three games? Is it possible? Uh, since the last update, the league friendly is things don't work. It's just large teams, not very large. We have to pay out more. Uh, it should still work. That's always the case. You always have to pay out more, but you get money because it's on TV. So that's always been the case. That was another fan day, actually. Uh, what did we even do? Did we win? Yeah, 3-0. Um, don't you think the game gets kind of boring having players that could already be playing in the first, second, maybe division? Um, not really, because we know it's not going to last. I think you'll, you'll um, be careful what I say. Like if you think it's going to be like this the entire save, then it's not. Um, but I'd expect you to know that, to be honest. Uh, I was thinking you could do a save with Heisenborg in Sweden. I subscribe to the best free transfers shortlist, but it's giving me the best one naked list. Uh, it shouldn't do. I'm, I almost feel like just putting the save on holiday for three years to stop people moaning. Probably should have done that. <laughs> Uh, when you quick inst quick result the games like that, don't they stop counting towards your win loss percent? Uh, I have no idea because I don't generally do it to be honest. Yeah, so I'm not sure. So slap, do you think this save is going to be this easy the whole way through? I'm just intrigued to see what you think because you put that comment. I'm just intrigued to see if you think it's going to be this easy the entire way through. Still, this is supposed to be the other times, but in real life, they're absolutely dominating the league. So I, I don't know what you're getting at. I'm, I'm struggling. <laughs> in real life, they're unbeaten, I think, or they've lost one game, but they're absolutely smashing the league. They're a two-star rep club playing in the fifth tier of Portugal in real life. The average in attendance is of £3,000. At 3,000 fans, like, that's... If that was the club in real life, they'd be soon back into the Premier League, back-to-back -back promotions. Just based on the money, really, that they're going to get from the attendances. So, you'll see in a few years, they'll be back to the Premier League. Um, I'm thinking of starting a new save in Germany. <clears throat> Lower League, any recommendations? 
Uh, I'm not sure. Not sure. How's it? How's it going? Being off and on listening while I do work. It's going all right. We're still winning. Um, am I the only one that saw 53 shots the last game? I missed that. I missed it. Like I say, once we start, do you honestly think we'll be able to afford these players if we've got a wage budget and we're semi-pro? Like, no way in a million years you'll be able to sign hardly any of these players when you can only offer like 200, 300 pound a week. Um, I just don't think it translates well to the game. I'm actually Portuguese. I know what you're saying. Just think the players Alan Rui has already played in the first division is kind of unrealistic. Yeah, I, I, I get it. Like, I understand, but it's just it. It's just FM. It's, it's always been the same. It's like a really good example is when people start in the twenty fourth tier of English of English leagues. Like, no way you're going to sign players at the 24th level. Like, the players you're going to sign are players from the 10th or, or 8th, 9th level. Which is why people just constantly get back-to-back -back promotions. Um, like, even starting in the 12th tier of English football. Um, yeah, you're always going to sign amazing players. The, the players don't go that far down. Right, I'm going to play the next game. What's he meant to do? Not sign good players? Yeah, I, I don't really know, to be honest. I understand what he's saying. Like, I, I do get what he's saying. Like I say, it happens in, in, in England. The players just aren't that bad. Uh, only 30 shots this time. Right, I'm going to quickly nip downstairs. I need to nip to the loo. Um, so I'll be back very, very shortly. We play the cup right here. So I'm just going to pop out an holiday and I'll be back very, very soon. Two minutes. Don't leave the stream. Make sure you like, like the stream as well.
Okay, I'm back. Do you reckon it's time to put the Lord on Facebook? Yeah, I'm going to make a decision tonight. Cause I, in regards to the next tier, I think the next tier is going to be exactly the same. So I don't know if tonight I should probably just do the season offline. I don't know. I think once we get to the third tier... When we can only sign Portuguese players, and we're probably going to be semi-pro, that's where it's going to get really difficult. Um, uh, what do you guys think? Did we win them games, by the way? We did. Because at the minute, I'm just kind of like holidaying and an instant resort in a few games. It's not exactly the best content that I want to put out there, you know what I'm saying? Mr. McGinister, what's going on, man? Yeah, I'm going to get Bentner out there. Let's do it. Everyone's going to be like, why are you calling him Stefan? Oh, did you see the Facebook post, by the way? Um... <laughs> I had like 36 comments of people calling me cheap. <laughs> um, yeah. All right, let me just do a post. Oh, did I not release the guy, by the way? I need to get rid of Nuno. Terminate loan, goodbye. Save me some money, please. Okay, so Nuno leaves, and Duarte can leave as well. That's going to save us a little bit of money, I guess. My youth sub cost 105k. Jeez. What's our balance now, by the way? Let me do this post. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Did we lose any players as well? I posted it. Um, are all the players on this list meant to be free? Uh, which ones? Which list? <laughs> I've posted Patsio. The bait's out there. Who's going to bite? We'll play this next game, though. These next two we'll play. 
One's a cup game, one's a league game. We do want to watch some football, of course. Um, okay, Spyro can kind of play on the wing, you know. Get the timer on it. <laughs> right, there we go. Here we go. Let's see if the Lord can get a goal. He scored quite a few, to be fair. So I, I, I think I know what I'm going to do. So later on tonight, once this stream's over, I, I don't particularly want to play the save offline by next season. I think what I'm going to do, just so people can see what's going on, essentially, um, I might do a members only stream where it's more I can just go off for a few minutes and stuff like that. Something like that, maybe tonight. We'll see. Just really, I, I just want to get to the third tier now. And then that's where it kind of begins, I guess. Just stream it. <laughs> Maybe, we'll see. Yeah, the, the what I'm saying there, Patsy, I don't just want to kind of just keep instant result in. It's not really the content I want to put out there. You know, I'm sure you can understand that. Uh, what? I'm in the fifth tier. Yeah, fifth tier. Someone got baited, did they? <laughs> Fishing knob. <laughs> That's funny. Is anyone else signed Bentner with Bill and Asus, by the way? I'm, I'm kind of annoyed that, uh, I mean, with, like, with 31, the, so Aguias are on 31 points. We're on 52, so we, it shouldn't be that long before we get the, um, the promotion, really. Oh, we're still in January, of course. We've got the cup game next. How much is Bentner receiving per month? Bentner's a free transfer. He's, he's not receiving. He's on an amateur contract. He's got no bonuses. He's got nothing. Uh, when people accuse you of cheating because of some transfers, they are overestimating the SI and the game. It's the same people who think that the AI learns your tactic. <laughs> Yeah, but I'm kind of glad that people are also doing the same save. You know what I'm saying? Why did Bentner accept that? Because we're amateur. Like, I really wish people would just start this save and go and sign these players, because you'll see yourself, you can do it. I, I shouldn't have posted that, Patsy Elf. <laughs> You're a knob. Like, trust me, start the save, you can do it yourself. You can go and sign Bentley, you can go and sign Rossi. Sign all these players as well. Don't blame the player, blame the game. Yeah, I agree. Just get rid of the people who ask why players are signing. <laughs> yeah, no, third tier, like, we know this. The third tier is going to be hard because she's probably going to turn semi-pro... You have to play all Portuguese players, essentially. 
So the third tier is is where the saver basically is going to start, I guess. That's where it's going to get tricky. And by then, you're probably going to be in debt as well. So, um, yeah, it's it's from that moment, I think that's where the save will officially kind of get hard. Can I spoil? No. You can't say that because I kind of want to know what it is now. Has anyone else been baited? Oh, we've got three comments. Uh, I tried to sign him in my grasshopper save and he wouldn't even go into contract talks with me. <laughs> People really think I'm hacking. Oh, dear me. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Roberto, what's going on, man? Playing the save, loving it so far. Andrew, are, are you signing good players as well? It's not just me, right? Please tell me you're signing a few good legends, right? We were champions of the tier that you're playing, nice. Okay, we do play a cup game now though, so I'm going to play this game. We want to watch the Lord up front, of course. When you finish the season, you'll find out. Oh, oh, that's that's a little bit. Um, oh, wonder if gave them that idea. What's happening with your work? What with my work? I'm just not working. <laughs> the hotel's closed, so yeah, I've still got like another two and a half week before it reopens. It might even be longer. We we don't know. Is this a TFF tactic? It's not. I've had this tactic for a long time. Played on FM19. Same one on FM19. Sign Alan Ruiz for my Storm Grads, good player. Bentner! There he is. Oh, Nicholas, the Lord himself. Cross as well, to be fair. Uh, why did you choose the challenge of Bilinasis? Um, I just love the story. Like, I feel sorry, obviously, for Bilinasis to get demoted all the way down to the fifth tier. Um, yeah, it's just the story, man. It's are you going to use the end of contract method to keep the players at the club? Uh, I'm not, I don't know. You named the Lord Stefan? Oh, it's my members. Um, anyone who's a member gets to choose a player they want. So you'll see, like, that says Dale, that's Stefan. They're in the chat. Signed a few. Darren Fletcher is awesome. Um, Niguez has just scored a great goal. Kill on that. Keeper should have done better, really. I'm still undefeated, yes. I mean, it's not exactly hard. Bentner, look at Bentner holding up the play. I mean, Bentner's got a bit of dribbling. It's like, it's like the new Ronaldo, look at him. Find his level, boys. Fifth tier of Portugal. Lindemann. In my opinion, you'll be lucky if things start to get normal at the end of May. Bender's probably have to score more goals for you already than his whole career. Question, every save I seem to start with, I click continue to go to the next few days. It seems to get slower and slower as the save goes on. Uh, it's probably down to your um, computer, to be fair. Yeah, no, I know. I, I, I've seen that. I've, I'm starting to learn a lot about Billionators, to be honest.
Any more people bit on the on the post? We've got five comments now, boys. <laughs> editor. <laughs> Saunders said I'm using the editor, boys. How about Facebook? I've not checked Facebook yet. What's Facebook saying about Buntner? Yeah, three comments. It's always, it's always Mathis, isn't it? Mathis just keeps commenting cheater. He's my mod in the channel. And... <laughs> funny but the funny thing is people just think i'm cheating all the time even though you guys know i'm not mathis you just keep posting cheater all the time i've seen it yesterday as well alan ruiz <laughs> yes you have mathis stop stop lying Aaron. Ruiz. Kendi. Oh, good ball. Spyro should have finished. <laughs> of course, Mathis. Lenderman. Where do you get the database? It's on our Discord channel. Oh my god, is that two free kicks to score in this game? Did you land all of the transfers live on stream? I did. <laughs> yes, I did. Patsy, you, you, do you like to get me like, do you like to see me get like trolled or, or abused? Is that the word? Aaron, Kendi. I encourage everybody to start this save and see for yourself. You can sign. You can sign these players. Oh, it's Tommy Hoban scored a goal. It's allowed. Uh, I didn't make a sub again. I don't think we need to, to be honest. I think if my players was twenty percent fitness, we'd still win. Ruiz is going for the run. Grand, what's going on, man? Uh, the tactic is in the Discord channel as well. What have I missed? Uh, Grant, we signed Lord Bentner. I mean, that's, that's all you need to know, really. I'm intrigued to see how much money we make from this IAK game, by the way. Yeah, I, I, I really want to know. I've got £1,400 available wage budget. Nice. That's because obviously we released the, um, the loan player. <laughs> How? You started to sound like everybody else, Grant. Everyone I've signed in today's stream was recommended by somebody else who is also doing the save. Uh, right, what's our balance on? So we're on... 222k for our balance, okay? Let's see if we make anything from this game. I hope they bring a few play a few fans, to be fair. So it is a Monday. Sweden to Portugal. Is it going to happen? How many away fans do you reckon IAK would bring to Portugal? What are you saying? A thousand? Maybe less. Oh, we've got the quarter-final draw, though. Uh, 
So we was on, what was we on? 224k. Come on. Get me like 60k, that would be great. One four one as well. Oh, I lost money. How did I lose money? Oh my god. <laughs> I lost money. How has that happened? It said the <laughs> it said the cost was zero and the income was like 35k. Oh, I've just been lied to. I can't believe I've just been trolled. Anything else on Twitter? Not really. Don't you get clubs from your league trying to sign them? No, you don't. I mean, you do get clubs trying to sign them, Slap. It's like, for example, I'll show you a player. Um, we signed someone called Bengalia. Um, on the 3rd of July. And within a month and a half, he had already left to go to Destroyers in Bolivia. Uh, on a free, he was with me a month. He didn't even play a single game for me. Um. So yeah, I mean, you can see the players we've kind of lost. I mean, really from here, to be honest, we've lost all of these already this season. The rest are kind of from from before we started. And you can see as well, like, <laughs> look how many is wanted. Alan Ruiz is about to leave as well, boys. Um, so yeah, we're going to lose him, but all of them are wanted. So we're going to lose them. Alan Ruiz is about to go to Udinese, I think. Which is, yeah, we know that's going to happen anyway. How you end 2.6 million in transfers? I haven't. That was from um, before. I have not earned anything from transfers. I can only offer contracts, so I c amateur contracts, so I can't earn anything. This is from this is we started the save, literally at this point right here. So all of this was done in real life, nothing to do with me. All of this was done in real life. So no, I'm not believing you again. No, I'm not doing any more friendlies. I lost the majority in one day. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna lose them, especially with it January as well. I'll try and offer him a new deal, but I don't think he will. Let's have a little look, shall we? Oh, they've bid it for him now. Yeah, it's, it's no, it doesn't want to. Yeah, Ruiz is about to go, boys and girls. Unfortunately. Uh, I'm in a cup competition, yes. Yeah, Udinese have gone for Ruiz. It's going to happen, we, we know this. We've enjoyed using him for six months, I guess. It could have been worse, he could have left after a month. You have Mareshi, I do, yes. Oh no, I don't want to lose him. Well, that's really annoying. He's like my best DLP. Is, I mean, look, is that an 806 rating? Yeah, it looks like I'm losing a lot of players at the minute. Eh. And now Kendi as well. I've just lost both my attacking midfielders. And you guys think this is easy? Come on. I've just lost my whole midfield. <laughs> Great. There's no way I can, like, there's no way 
I've just lost Magia as well. So the other striker's gone. Uh, the Colombian. Um, Kamara has gone, the midfielder. Uh, Oliver's gone. And Kendi's gone. And I'm about to lose Vignati as well. I guess we might need to do some more signing soon. Though he's opted to stay, actually. Good. There you go, Slap. <laughs> he was talking about losing players. That's a good example right there that day. We still have some good players, though, of course. Um, I'm, I'm avoiding signing any players or putting any players on any kind of wage budget. I, I don't think we need to. Like, So, I mean, what we've just lost, <laughs> the whole middle we've just lost. Um, so, DLP, we're going to have to play Brute. We could do with a new DLP, though. Uh, I mean, we do have plenty of options. We've got Mureshi to now play there. And I guess Ross McCormack is going to be playing there. Um, I do need a better DLP, though. Is my director available to find anything? Uh, I don't recognize any of them. Gustafo Coleman. That passing is pretty good. His physicals are terrible. Tiago Gomez. Would be a shout and bring him in. Does anyone know Tiago Gomez? Portuguese guys in the chat. Tiago Gomez. That's 34. Um, Benfica, I'm assuming you might know him from. Not really played in Portugal, to be fair. Bring him in as well. Let's bring just bring in two. Okay. Is there any AMCs available? He's bad. He's got good flair. Augusto. It's, there's still really good players available. And mana. Okay, we'll go with this. We're going to play this game. Everybody's leaving. We've still got the Lord, though. And we've got now Ross McCormack be playing behind the Lord Bentner, so. I mean, you couldn't wish for anything better. Ross McCormack playing behind the Lord Bentner. Come on. Yeah, please drop a like on the stream, boys. Massively appreciate it. Sometime in history, Thiago Gomez was a prospect from Benfica when there wasn't a very good youth academy. Oh, nice. Uh, we're about to go 1 0 down. I blame this on losing the three midfielders. Oh, he's missed. He's actually missed the penalty. Okay. Oh, Benton has just been fouled. We've got a penalty now, and the Lord steps up. Oh, no, McCormack. Never mind. So yeah, later on today, I might decide to do a members-only stream. It's not something that's going to be a regular occurrence, by the way. But I think... Um... I'm turning pro. Now I don't know if to do that. <laughs> if we turn pro next season... I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I'll decide later. I might want to just get next season done tonight and then come back tomorrow do a long stream in the third tier or something we'll see i'll see how it goes i'm not promising anything but i i, I just think the save will kind of start from the third tier personally this will get kind of difficult it's not gonna be like um 
not going to be a um, an entertaining streamer. Like that. I'll be AFK and stuff like that. It'll just be for. I just don't like playing offline. I hate it. As long as I can like talk to somebody while the members only and stuff. I didn't want to turn pro. I can't believe you've turned pro. I did tell you no spoilers and you've already failed. Ross McCormack is making a name for himself in Portugal. Yeah, I think if I turn pro in the fourth tier, I'm fucked. They're going to lose a ridiculous amount of money. This save is about to turn on its head next season if we turn pro. I spoiled it already. I, I, I kind of knew. I, I knew what you were saying when you said wait till the end of the season. I, I knew what you was on about, Andre. That's why you should stream it. If you do want to become a member, by the way, if you look below the video, it should say join. Um, you can join and become a member. Ain't so easy now. I know, right? I mean, we are dominating. We just scored. Mareshi just scored his first goal. <laughs> Any more things on the Bentner? Get on the Bentner. No, nothing. How about Facebook? There's five comments on Facebook now. Not bad, not, not too many bites. McCormack has scored a hat-trick in his first game. Um, maybe a little hidden hero in the Portuguese lower leagues. What do you reckon? Ross McCormack? I don't know, you know. Ross McCormack's not a bad player. I actually work at Billy Nasus in the youth team. Well, you could have told your employer to retweet me. I mean, they, they completely even liked the tweet. They, they completely ignored me. I think you need to go and tell off the chairman. Or the social media manager, actually, not the chairman. Tag, tag Bentner on Twitter, social media. Yeah, maybe. No one ever seems to reply. Yeah, Ruiz, of course. What did he go on? He went like he went to Udinese on 10k per week, and he was playing in the fourth tier of Portugal for six months. I mean, it looks good on his records, you know, 18 appearances, 17 goals. He's already scored a goal for Udinese as well. It's crazy. No, I've never signed Messi, ever. Hal Kane's have come in for Vignati, who is a another Portuguese team. And Juan's about to leave as well to Oriental Dragon. That's a really good name for a Portuguese club. I really like that. They have a hot prospect here. That's mad moving from the fourth tier of Portugal. <laughs> it's crazy. It really is. It's pretty mental. Oriental Dragon is a Chinese team. I mean, it sounds like it, to be fair. It sounds like a takeaway, to be honest. I'm sure there's an Oriental Dragon restaurant near me. Sam Renato played stupidly good and sold him. Too stupid to get the best players. Yeah, the wages and stuff are crazy. Uh, 
Uh, so Thiago Gomez, I guess the um, the midfielder joins, as well as Abdi as well. Are we signed in two two older players? Sounds more like a dining place. They'll kind of replace, of course. Um, despite being an amateur league, they have four practices four days a week. I mean, them them signings, <laughs> not too bad. Like this Abdi guy is like three and a half star. So I'm I'm gonna kind of put him there. I think got a few injuries and stuff now, but instead of Jamie Brew, play Abdi. Not bad. DLP. We still haven't played Fred Friday or Eduardo yet. <laughs> um, yeah, interesting. What we got left? So, I mean, we haven't got that many games left, to be honest. You guys want me to just finish the season today? Alright, what are you saying, chat? Are you guys going to stick with me throughout the stream if I finish the season today? And we'll see if we go pro. Should we, should we just get it done today? I think. What are you saying, chat? Yeah, we'll keep going. We'll keep going. Of course, we're not going to play all of them anyway, so it's just a bit con continuing, I guess. So I'm really, really scared that the club's going to go pro. And that's a really, really bad thing. The club does not need to go pro. Um, yeah, the, the club doesn't need to go pro at all. We could still get promotion next season, stay in amateur. It's going to be such a bad idea if they go pro. I ain't looking forward to this, because they're going to lose a fuck ton of money. But if the board decides to do it, then yeah, we've got no choice. Uh, the Belenza story reminds me of the Stay Book Arrest a little when they had to rename. Yeah, it doesn't feel like a Friday to be fair. I wonder if we can start getting some loans next season so we can have a little bit of like security in our team. Because at the minute there's like no security in our team whatsoever and it's really annoying me. You know? At least with loans. But you have to spend money for loans. At least with loans you're not going to lose them. Some clubs in the second tier aren't pro so you're probably safe. Carlos, I'm just saying that because a few of the guys who's doing this save have turned pro. Um, that's my only concern. I just need to know if they're going to send me pro. I run 4 0. Hey, I need to go and get a drink. So I'm just going to pop out on holiday quick. I'll be back in two minutes. So let me just go and grab a drink. I might grab a beer, actually. I'm going to go put a beer in the fridge. So bear with me two minutes.
Okay, I'm back. I've only got one type of beer. I don't know if you can. I don't know if this is a good idea. <laughs> um, rip. <clears throat> Put yourself to a beer. I am doing it. Don't worry about that. Uh, well, still on a contract. I think so. I think he's on loan, though, is he not? I oh, I'm still on Ollie. <laughs> Just waiting for it. Oops. Let me come back a full Ollie. Right, I'm going to assume we had no. Does anyone know the date of the intake? I'm hoping we don't miss it. Okay. Did we win? Yeah, we, we're still winning. Okay. We've got the cup next as well, which is good. Have Cronenberg. Let's have a look at Naki Wells. Yeah, and I, he went to Bristol City. Oh, no, he didn't. Was he always a Bristol City? Yeah, he was always a Bristol City, actually. He got recalled, I think, if I remember rightly. Contract doesn't end until 2023. Might be in the Premier League by then, boys. Oh, Naki Wells, we know he can bang the goals in. I need to probably change the emotes, actually, in the stream. It was on loan at QPR, then got a record. Yeah, Burnley to QPR, got recorded, then got sold. I remember. Um, Luke, what's going on, man? I've just seen you pop in. I just really want to know now if we get made professional. It's going to change. Like, I know it's still early in the save, but it's going to change everything if we go professional. It honestly is. You have no idea how much money we're going to lose. That's where it starts to get serious. So I'm pretty sure, I'm hoping I can still offer amateur contracts. But then if you're pro, can you offer amateur contracts? Or is it just the non-contract where you've got to play the bonuses? So at the minute I'm amateur, so I don't even have to offer bonuses. So if we go pro, it's... I don't know how we're going to survive. We're literally getting no money for winning any cups, any leagues. We're getting no money at all. So how am I expected to make any money? Oh, it's going to be tricky, this. Let's see if it happens first. Um... Of course, I'm not going to ask for it. Like, you can't offer amateur. Oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> I really hope they don't make me pro. Oh, I'm going to cry if we do. Sound on the stream go out? Is it just my ends? Um, but you can't hear me, so I can't reply to that. If someone can just type. Uh, I thought Blythe had a cool badge, so I started to save... They're starting to save their predicted bottom and 442 again working wonders. I'm masked up after 10 games left. Nice. Yeah, we did a live save on FM18. Now we are in the quarter final of this cup, so it would be nice to win a cup. Um Welcome to Wear Foot Club. Yeah, um oh I really want to know boys. This save is gonna get real interesting very quickly. We go pro. Okay, I should probably put some some subs on, right? I'm not doing that. I'd rather put you guys there. Okay, uh, Bentner. Go with this. Oh, I'm excited. Oh, I told you boys, like, have fun signing all these good players while you can, because it's going to end, you know? Talking of good players. Any more? Any more bites? Nope. 
Right, let's try and get through to the, the semi-final, though. That would be nice. I mean, we should do. We should win this cup, really. Only Corona. Yeah, only Corona. Oh, good save. Almost went 1-0 down. Right, I don't know how we can't win this cup. We're still unbeaten in the league as well. We've only drawn one game. I mean, you know, it's... Kind of annoyed we drew that game, to be honest. Cormac. Ah. Who are we even playing? Are these in the same league as ours? Or in the different group? I don't think we've played against these before, have we? There is a club called CF Benfica. Oh, 1-0. Spyro is doing actually pretty good on the wing. It's got 17 goals. That's kind of a mixture between advanced forward and the wing, though. Yeah, it's not doing too bad. Dashi, I'm assuming you can keep the players you've got on amateur contracts, though, right? Which might help a little bit, I guess. Aaron. Go on, get cross in. Nice. There are a lot of clubs called Benfica. Of course there is. Where's the Lord? I've not seen the Lord this game. I locked down my stars ASAP. Oh, I'm nervous about this next we do. What what date did he go pro, by the way? Was it when the start of the season in June? Or was it announced when you finished the last game? Reshi. Friendlies are going to be very, very important. The lawyers. Abdi. See if you can get a senior affiliate as well. Aaron. The Lord works in mysterious ways, I know. So many shots. As soon as I won the league. <clears throat> I guess we should get that message very soon then, right? So I, I'm pretty sure we're like, we, we have to win the league short, soon, surely? I don't know how many points clear we are, but we've only drew one game the entire season. We've, we must be a few points clear of third place. Let's get this, um, let's get this cup game out of the way. Yeah, Mareshi gets his third goal. Zurich is my affiliate. What, Zur what with, um, with Bilinesis? You mean senior affiliate or affiliate? I know I asked this question last time, but is it actually possible to, to get affiliates in different nations? Just turn pro second season. Yeah, it looks like we're going to turn pro, boys. That's two people now. Three people that's turned pro. Oh, but... Uh, uh, Angel didn't go pro. I don't know. It's just going to... It's, it's going to be one of the things if the board decides to turn us pro. So three of you have turned pro. Why one of you haven't? Uh, okay. Okay. If the board decides to go to the pro, then surely that'll be on administration. I think so. I can't see how we're going to make any money. Three people have turned pro, though, doing this save. After the first season. And Pat Sear has just gone pro now as well. That's four people have gone pro. 
why one hasn't. Hopefully I make it 4-2 <laughs> and I don't turn pro. Oh boy, is this save going to get interesting. I'm excited for this. Oh, the, the challenge begins. <laughs> Trying to survive as a pro club in the fourth tier. The only pro club in the fourth tier. <laughs> oh dear. Plus of, um, of course, spending, you know, 40k a month on your facilities. Rip. I think this might be one of the hardest challenges we're going to do, to be honest. It's, um... Yeah. It's so weird, isn't it? Like, how easy it is compared to how hard it's going to get by going pro. Yeah, we'll see. We're through to the next round of the cup, though. Hey, wants an improved deal for Spyro. Okay, I'm going to give you zero from zero. There you go, that's your improved deal. Can you increase gate receipts? You can't, no. Only the board can do that. But well, I'm assuming, like, we're, we're 21 points clear. Does anyone know how many more games I need to win? We are playing, like... So, I think this is the team that... Who's the team that's third? Oh, where is... We don't play them again. I guess around this point, we might go pro. Uh, we might win the league. Or get promoted, at least. Watch those finances fall. Yeah. I was 23, but lost one. Yeah, I've not lost one yet. I mean, these are second, so we're gonna. If we win this, we're gonna build the gap on second at least. Uh, but of course, we are in the semi-final, and we play CF Benfica, boys and girls. I think these are in the league above, right? Yeah, this is the league that we're going to. If yeah, these are the league above. Okay, yeah, that's interesting. So I'm playing a team. The only team left in the league above where the other two teams are in our league. So if we can win that, we're definitely going to play that game. Because that's going to be an interesting game. What's your final goal for the save to win the Champions League? Something that we have not done on FM18 and FM19 with Madeira. So that's the aim. Is to, to try and just win that Champions League. It's just impossible. Like It almost feels impossible. Because coming up against teams like PSG, when you've got zero money all the time. There's a game you play between a team who won a different cup at the start of the season, like a Unit Shield. At least you can get a few cups under the belt, I guess. How do you bring in first league players with your team? Uh, because we're amateur and we're massive. I'm just going to leave it at that. Because we're amateur... And we're massive. Okay, we've got Sporting Club Elinda Avella. See what we can do. And we should have the youth intake very, very, very soon. After three games, you will win the league. Yeah, I think so. And then let's see. I'm assuming you guys got it after the you you, you got the the message where you won the league, yeah. You'll decide the championship on a neutral ground match. Yeah, but we're gonna get promoted though either way, right? Need to use all the youth players in the next league if pro. Yeah, I I I kind of agree with that. Um, I'm just literally waiting for, um, for the message for my youth intake. I'm hoping we get someone good. I'm nervous with pro status. Uh, yeah, I'm very nervous, man. I, I, yeah. This is going to go wrong on so many levels. 
you're already losing 40k a month at the minute because of your facilities and your ground and stuff never mind going pro and not being able to offer amateur players contracts amateur contracts in a league where everybody else is amateur it's yeah it's, it's, it's gonna be hard it's gonna be really really hard you know when i said at the start of the save enjoy the moment this year where you can sign good players yeah well you know it's gonna be a long time before you get the type of them players again Dear me. Okay, we're gonna. Um, I might play this game. I'm gonna instant resolve this one. Only way you can survive pro is by selling players. Yeah, I know. And of course, friendlers. You're gonna need to get some good friendlers in. Lots and lots of leagues to survive. Trust me, get as many as you can in in preseason. Try and build the balance up if you can. Even if it's twenty k game, you know. Oh, we won one nil. Okay, we still not got the message that we won the league. Scouting range. Oh. Have they upgraded your scouting range as well? <laughs> oh dear me. Right, we should have the intake this week, I'm hoping. What have they upgraded it to? Europe? You could already do Portugal, right? How did you skip that match? We have an instant result button. We don't generally use it, but... This season's quite easy, so I'm I'm making the most of it. It's on a skin, you have to have a skin. Yeah, it's the one chop brew skin. Right, where's this youth intake? <clears throat> Beginning mid March. Yeah, it should be it should be soon. There we go, is it this day? Nope. Sometimes it lags a little bit. One more win, I think so. I'm going to instant result here, yeah, I think. <clears throat> I, I just want to know now if I'm going pro. But yeah, this intake might be very important for next season. Might just have to, like, use them as depth or something. You know? I'm hoping we get some good kind of players, but it's 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 it's, it's possible. Like we, we've already got some really good players seen on other people's youth intakes. What was your youth intake like, Patsio? And Dashi, what was yours like? Oh, you ain't got it yet? Okay. I'm assuming it's the end of March then. You're very close to me in terms of time. <clears throat> My youth intake was pretty bad. Uh, oh, what was that? Okay. No intake yet. <laughs> I'm trying to work at the same time. <laughs> We're nearly there. We're nearly there. Went on a great cup run with Blythe and got to the FA Cup third round. City away. Nice. 
I love it when that happens. Which is very rare for me. Three screens, I'm watching a film. Uh, the members link does not work for me. Nothing comes up about joining or five tiers. Um, it should do, Holmes. Is there not like a little join button under the video? Next to the subscribe button. There should be a video, uh, a join button. Hundred and seventy four people watching, sixty five likes. Come on, boys, drop a like on the video. Try and get it. Oh, we actually drew nil nil. Are you being serious? <laughs> I actually drew. I actually drew. Okay, we've got to wait. <laughs> How annoying. That's really annoying. Okay, definitely one more game and then we're promoted. But don't forget, we won't ever instant result this going forward now. This is only for kind of like... At this point. Because the league's so easy. And I just want to see if we're going to go semi-pro. Uh, go pro, sorry. How did Tommy Hoban accept to be in Bill Um, You can do it. You can get lots and lots of players. Like, you're amateur and you've got really big rep. Means lots and lots of good players for no money. So yeah, you can do it yourself. I need to find this youth intake. I've uh, been listening to the Farsi save when driving my truck makes the day fly by. All I hear is knack trick. <laughs> Love a good knack trick. <clears throat> Naki Wells was a beast, though. In them lower leagues, he completely, like, just destroyed everything. 26 for so in my Portugal saves. Okay, so it's not too far away. It's probably going to be crap. To be I mean, have you ever seen me get a really good youth intake? I don't think you have. So I'm not, I'm not banking on it, really. I just want to get this game out of the way just to see if we go professional. How much do you know of the Portuguese lower leagues? Um, I'm okay. Not too bad. I've done it three years in a row. Three FM versions in a row. That, uh, that one time in Madeira you got a good AMC the first year. I remember that, yes. Yeah, I remember that guy. Wasn't he not the um it wasn't Portuguese though, was he? It was the other nation. Um I forgot what the other nation is. I know who you mean though. Okay, here we go. We've got to win this game and then we the third as well, so it's very important. Win this and we're promoted. Second season got Kabeye in. Adam, I'm assuming you didn't go semi-pro. Did you go pro then, or not? Oh, Ross, welcome, man. Come and get some love in the chat. Three-star potential as well. Please show, show Ross some love. What a guy. Come and get a GG in the chat for Ross. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Oh, you're going pro at the end of the season. Ah, okay. That makes sense. Are you just trying to get some amateur players in now just to see if they stay? So you can keep them amateur? <laughs> I feel like that's what you're doing right now. Right, win this, and let's see if we're going to go pro. 
Come on. If we lose this game, I'm going to be furious. And before we lose, are you ready? We're going to lose. Are we going to go forwards? What's going to happen? Game, come on, game. I I didn't save the game actually the entire stream, so. Okay, four one. Ten oh no. <laughs> I don't want to press it. I, I really don't want to press it. I feel like the save is going to be over if we go pro. We're going to get absolutely battered with money. We've been promoted, of course. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Uh, and I say no. Oh. How about we try and convince them to go semi pro? Semi-pro will be really good, because I can tie it out. I don't know what to do here. Ah, boys, what do I press? <laughs> um... Or do I just go pro like everybody else? Do I just, do I just go pro and... and... <sighs> I don't know. Should I try semi-pro? We see no reason to consider making such a step at this point. Does that mean that they've... So, so what's happening? So, I mean... I don't know what's just happened. <laughs> sacked. Um, imagine if we get sacked. So, so what are they deciding to do? Like, I don't understand what that meant. Why do I have to make everything difficult for myself? I. <laughs> so. I don't know. Does that mean I'm staying amateur? Bob Vision. I I what what kind of thing is that? Okay. I I I've I've I'll oh, fuck. Yeah, okay, I've gone pro. I didn't really mean to press that. Okay, I'm going to join in with the struggle with everybody else. I think it's only fair. I did get out of that, though, by the way. So I did get out of going pro, but I'm going to join the struggle with everybody else. Um, Why not? Why not? So I'm going pro. I'm going to save it. <clears throat> Yeah, we're going to go pro. I could have got out of that, though. I could have stayed amateur. But I feel sorry for everybody else who's going to be losing all the money. I'd rather join the, join the struggle. Did you guys not like negotiate? You could have black like negotiated to stay like amateur. I am uh, just <laughs> I wonder what's going to happen now though. 
Yeah, I, I really wonder what's going to happen. Um. Yeah. I really should have negotiated. I mean, yeah, you should have really. I mean, I've only got a hundred and eighty-five thousand in the bank. I don't know why they would turn you pro at that point. Next season, Santiago Mogado is really good. Yeah, I'll have a look. I'll have a look. Uh, I mean, what's the rules in the next league that we're going to, by the way? And what have we got left? Still got a, a while yet. Um, let me look at the rules for the next league. I'm assuming it's the same as what we're in. Stages. Rules. Um, yeah, there's, there's no rules in terms of what's really annoying. Like, the, the best club in this league is Atletico CP. Um... To be fair, they're so actually really good players. Like, this guy's approach to sign is fucking pretty good from CF Benfica. Like, I'm gonna get this, I'm just gonna steal him from CF Benfica before, um, before we play them. Oh, I've got them in the semi final, so I'm just gonna take the two best players. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I've got them in the semi final, so I'm just taking the two best players. Um, who's this guy as well? He's pretty good as well, to be honest. I want to take him as well. Okay. Yes, we went pro, Pats. Yeah, we did. Uh, we go pro. What was the date? Um, 27th of July, though. It's usually earlier than that. I believe it'll probably be um, in June time. Can't believe you're pro already. I know, it's, it's crazy, man. It, I had no sign on my scouting range, though. Like, there was nothing on my scouting range. Uh, maybe we should ask for that, to be honest. Um, I can't ask for it yet, to be honest, either. I'm not going to do my youth recruitment. No way. No way we're doing that. Right, where's this youth intake? Got promoted, at least, which is amazing news. I just want to see my youth intake now. I guess we're just going to try and keep all our amateur players we've got at the moment. We're just going to try and keep the lot of them. <laughs> and just keep them on amateur contracts as long as possible. Like, if we're turning professional, we're going to need a budget as well, right? So, I don't know how that's going to work. I can't believe I just took. <laughs> <laughs> the two players from Benfica. Uh, uh, CF Benfica, the league above, by the way, not the main Benfica. Okay, my intake. Absolutely shite. Absolutely dreadful, as usual. Right, boys and girls, that is me done for the day. Um, I am actually going to be back tonight. But it's going to only be for members just to finish the season off and have a little chat about the save. Um, so that'll just be for the members tonight. Not something that I'm going to do. I just want to get and start the season tomorrow. Um, so yeah, if you are a member, make sure you drop by about 8pm, we're going to do another hour or so, hour, two hours, um, and we're just going to finish the season basically, because the season's won now, so I don't want to start on that tomorrow, um, but yeah, if you are a member, make sure you check that out tonight, and I'll be back tomorrow, I don't know what time, probably 3pm tomorrow, 
It is Saturday, so 3 p.m. We're going to start the season. We're going to see what happens when we go pro. It's going to be a big stream tomorrow. Um, we'll probably start from the 1st of like July tomorrow or something. Of course, the members will see that earlier and later tonight. But yeah, it's been a pleasure, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, everybody. Laters.